How's it going YouTube view? I'm Tombstone Thoughts back here again with a brand new video and today is I just got done watching uh, Clash of the Castle and a lot of good things have happened with that. A seen a lot of celebrities there, including like Tyson Fury knocking out Theory, Austin Theory. Love that moment. Seeing Solo Sequoia get involved, uh, and I'll remember the bloodline. And of course, a lot of good other matches. One that was a shocker seeing Dominic Mysterio turning heel against Edge and of course Ray. A shocker there. But before all that, obviously today was a big thing for me because apparently I uh, found out that Kevin Nash was actually somewhere here in Michigan for some signing in that. And of course I got I went there with this with my mock belts winged eagle if you guys checked up on my uh, social medias like on Instagram and on Twitter I posted it there it's me standing there with a photo of him and of course right here he signed it diesel because he was daddy cool diesel when he held this version of the title had a nice conversation he even said about them talking about changing the the undisputed WWE Universal Championship to this to the wing back to the winged eagle, which I would highly say Probably because this is a great version of the belt. I mean, it's the, it was probably one of the longest Running design of the belt in WWE history I mean it ran from 88 to 98 and then big eagle it was for nine from 98 to like 2002 which was only about four or five years undisputed was like from 2000 Two to 2005, three years. Spinner belt, eight years. Came close to being with that one, 2005 to 2014. Then it was the big, uh, big logo belt. Only one year when they unified it with a big gold belt. Then there was uh, the network logo belt, which is still being used today, from 2015 to 2022. But hopefully they go back to original design. But anyway, that's pretty much just to talk about the fact that I met Kevin Nash. Got a photo with him and had him sign my winged eagle belt. So now that was glorious. And plus two, Clash of the Castle was a great pay-per-view to see it. Obviously, there wasn't much of changing of title reigns. Obviously, you barely have any title changes that go up overseas. Especially to a pay-per-view that was just one out of chances it was the first time in 30 years guys they had a pay-per-view over there in new england so i oh, no, not new england in, in the uk i don't know why i said new england sorry guys but uh yeah in the uk the first time all that and of course sheamus versus gunther was a great match obviously everyone retained the titles every, and i don't remember i don't think the usos were there but their brother solo sequoia who was from nxt Went in there to help their cousin Roman Reigns to retain his undisputed title, which I'm thinking, sooner or later, I want someone to, to I want the titles off of Roman. I we are in the age now where no one wants to see someone hold the title for five years on that. They, Bruno San Martino is the one that holds the record for seven years. I don't want to see Roman Reigns up there at a seven-year-long reign. So there, there's a reason why nowadays you don't see title reigns lasting that long because a, it feels bland after a while when there's, it's like what are they gonna do? Like literally everyone that tries and fails. It's pointless. So hopefully soon he will lose the title. He didn't lose the title yet, but eventually he probably will. But anyway, that's enough from Randy for me. I'm gonna probably do some uh. Restoning work because I got some new stones coming in. I mean, it just came in today, so I'm going to do more restoning work on probably my Blue Universal title. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Don't forget to leave a like. Don't forget to comment. Don't forget to subscribe and share as well. But as well, follow me and comment below what you guys think. And plus, uh, again, thanks you, thanks to Kevin Nash for signing my belt. Thank you, man. <laughs> Anyway, uh, and uh, don't forget to follow me on my social media, like as well, like I said, on Twitter, DMTrimstone96, and of course on Instagram, at DMTrimstone 96 where I posted photos there of me with Kevin Nash, and I'll post up there before probably I post them here on my YouTube channel. So anyway, I'm DMTrimstone Belts, and I'll see you guys in the next video.